guys so i am so excited to be able to do this review on the black panther movie it was absolutely phenomenal if you don't have your tickets for any point this weekend i need you to get on it like right now like go order your ticket but i wanted to share my review because i wanted to talk about it not just on the hype of why it was a good movie but it really really like was really a good movie the acting was great the storyline was great it was full of plot twists like every other scene i was like wait 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 where did that come from why is this happening what's going on it was so phenomenal like to the extent i probably need to watch it again just to like really understand everything that happened but they did a really, really good job, and there was such a great attention to detail. Um, one question that I have, like, how real is this story? Like, I know Africa is a powerful place, and I plan to get there one day, but, like, is this real? <laughs> like, it, it, that's really how it felt. Like, I wouldn't be surprised if it is real, to be honest, but... I really, really, really walked away like, okay, where is this place? Are these the African princes that are trying to marry Americans? Like, should I respond to those emails a little bit quicker? <laughs> but really, like, real questions here. Um, but beyond that, when I tell you, it was absolutely phenomenal. This movie has gotten so much attention even before it premiered. Um, but for the most part, it was two groups of people. You had African Americans who were willing and ready and eager to support this movie simply because it existed. Then you had um, some people of the white community who, A, ignorantly thought it was about the Black Panther Party. Which, even if it was, I would still support it just as strongly. But that wasn't even the point. It, it's a Marvel movie. B, you had people of the white community who were just pissed off just because of the title. Like, y'all gotta do better. Like, really. Because at the end of the day, it, the title <laughs> is the name of the comic. Just with every other Marvel movie, like really and truly. But one thing I enjoyed the most about this movie in particular, um, I'm not going to say I'm a Marvel fan, but I do enjoy Mar the Marvel movies that I've seen, I've enjoyed. Um, however, with most Marvel movies, you have one or two token black people or people of color. One or two. This was tokenism in reverse. <laughs> Everybody in the movie was black except like two people. It was phenomenal. Absolutely phenomenal. And one of the the guardians, the, the bald ladies that were protecting the kingdom, one of them was my sorority sister. So you know I had to be there to support this movie. My one criticism of this movie, the only criticism that I have, it's really unfair that the hero and the villain looked as good as they did. Like, how am I supposed to choose Marvel? Seriously? Like, they both look good. And it's just like, how do you root for either? Because as they were fighting shirtless, and I was just like, I don't even care who win. But, like, I care. But, like, it's just not right. It's just, it's just not right. Villains are supposed to be ugly and unattractive and repulsive. <laughs> it's not fair. It's not fair. <laughs> but I say that to say it was a phenomenal movie. Absolutely phenomenal. I loved every second of it. Um... I should not have gone after working all day because I was exhausted. However, even if I was sitting like this, <laughs> I 
I was in to every minute of the movie really and truly. Um, again, if you have not gotten your tickets to see it, go order your ticket now. It's a great movie. Like, even if you aren't into comics, it's a really, really good movie. And it was funny. Like, I wasn't expecting it to be that funny. But it was, like, like funny, funny. Like, hmm. I'll take it. All right, guys. See you next time.